everyone, welcome to Eki Now with Melly Mel. I'm Melissa. Today, I am bringing you another magical video. I am actually going to show you my newest Harry Potter pin acquisition. Now, this is a pin that was released on Tuesday, this past Tuesday, <laughs> on Lunchfly's website. This was actually a surprise release because as a lot of you might know, Lunchfly has been releasing mini jumbo pins every Tuesday at 9 a.m. Pacific, 12 p.m. Eastern. These are limited edition box pins and they are mainly Disney pins, but they also have pins from other fandoms. They've had had Hello Kitty pins, they have had Ghostbusters pins, they have had Harry Potter pins, which is what I want to show you today. Um, and again, just really different fandoms, but mainly Disney. So these Loungefly pins have been something that I have been following every single month because Loungefly is really good at letting you know what's coming out each Tuesday because every month they'll release a pin flyer. I'm actually going to show you the pin flyer for March, so you should be seeing that right now. And the pin that I just got, again, was really more of a surprise. Reason why I say it was a surprise is because this past Tuesday, we were actually supposed to have the Funko Pop pin, which was kind of a pin to honor all of those pop collectors out there. But something happened that last minute, we actually got a really cool limited edition of 800 boxed Harry Potter pin. So I ordered that as soon as I heard that this pin was live, which actually is still available. As of the time that I am filming this video, the pin is still available. So you see, I had a squirrel moment. <laughs> squirrel. But nonetheless, I ordered this pin right away and I just got it on Saturday. So it got here really quick and I was just so pleasantly surprised that this was actually a surprise drop. But let me stop talking and Let's see this pin. All right, so before I show you the pin, I wanted to point out that I am wearing a bow band. I typically don't wear bow bands, but my friend Amy over at Geekably Cute made this bow band for me. She actually gifted this to me a little over a year ago, but I just had not shown it to you guys. This is actually supposed to be potions inspired, like a Harry Potter inspired bow band. It actually had a little cauldron right here, but it fell off. <laughs> but nonetheless, it is still a super cute bow band. She's more focused on making Harry Potter inspired jewelry and Star Wars inspired jewelry. So if you like any of those things, definitely check out her Etsy shop, Geekably Cute. But now, this is what I wanted to show you guys. So this right here, is the newest Harry Potter pin released through Lunchfly's website. This again was a surprise release. And as with all the Tuesday releases that we get from Lunchfly, this is a mini jumbo box pin. All of these Tuesday pins come in boxes similar to this one. And I really love the packaging. So let's get a closer look. And as you can see on the box, it says Harry Potter Wizarding World. It also says Loungefly at the bottom. And here we have a look at the back of the box. Again, it is a limited edition of 800. It says batteries are not replaceable. And yes, this pin lights up. I was so excited to see that this pin actually lit up. And we have an owl there, like Hedwig, and the retail price for this pin was $25. And here we have a closer look, as you might have been able to tell. This is the Basilisk, there we go. <laughs> so this is such a really cool pin, and fun fact is that I am now reading the Harry Potter books. I started with the movies, and I am reading the books now, and I'm actually reading the Chamber of Secrets right now. It is super cool that this pin just came out as I am finishing the book. So, so cool. And as you can see, this is a hinged pin, and on the inside, it reveals the basilisk. And here we have a closer look. It has a metallic look and feel to the pin like a vault. And it is raised here. The artwork on the pin is raised and texturized. So it kind of feels like snake skin, like it should, right? Like a serpent. And there we see the basilisk. 
And on the back of the pin, it has a button that you can press for the light to come on. So the eyes on the basilisk light up a red color. Let me turn off the lights here so you can see that a little better. And here we have the back of the pin. It has lounge flies waffling on the back, which is the crown. And this button right here, as you can see, turns on the light. And I'm actually really pleased and happy to see that my pin actually works because I had purchased another lounge fly mini jumbo pin last year. It was actually the Oliver and Company mini jumbo pin and that pin was supposed to light up as well but mine was defective and I guess they had a lot of the Oliver and Company pins that were defective that the light was not working and um, I reached out to them and I asked for a replacement and then they said that they were going to have another wave of those pins made and I had to mail the one to them and it just seemed too much of a hassle so I just ended up just keeping the pin as is with the defective light but I am still trying to figure out if there's a way for me to replace the battery. I mean this pin clearly says on the back of the box that the battery is not replaceable but come on something has got to be done so i'm sure i'll figure it out at some point but again this is the back of the pin a limited edition of 800 something that i was really happy to see as well is that it is licensed by warner brothers so that's another thing that i really like about the lounge flight pins is that not only do they have official Disney licensed pins, but these Harry Potter pins are also officially licensed. And that's it you guys, let me know in the comments down below what you thought about this pin and I just realized that I was just asking you to look into the basilisk eyes. Oh my goodness, shame on me. <laughs> but again, let me know what you thought in the comments. Let me know if we are pin twins and if you collect Harry Potter pins. And as usual, if you love the things that I talk about, definitely subscribe, comment, like, and hit that notification bell so that you can keep waking out with me. Bye!